All right, so hopefully none of you guys are too damaged from the last Soyuz event. We got um, a new, not new, it's a rerun banner, but a new banner regardless uh, as of right now. So there's four, sh well, I would say three because Formi's been there for years now. On this banner, Pompeo, Impero, Trieste, and Formi. Now, uh, are any of these ships actually worth spending your cubes on? I'm going to tell you guys right now. Not really. Um, I think the best ship as of right now from this banner is probably Impero. And that's mainly because if you guys are lacking like supportive healing ships or whatever, or just like support ships in general, Impero is actually very good in Chapter 15. Um, but Chapter 15 has been somewhat nerfed lately. Uh, not on the initial clear, but like the clear, like three star clears after they got pretty nerfed. And Guam and Laffy 2 came out like what three months ago as well, too. So, chapter 15 is much easier than on release date. So, there's a lot of leeway for this. Um, and Peril is probably like the best ship you're going to get right as of right now. A very supportive uh, carrier. And honestly, if you guys don't know about chapter 15, it's all about support carriers. Like the. All your heals and whatever, that's what carries you in chapter 15. So this ship right here has okay damage. It has um, a decent amount of speed for uh, air strikes as well too. Like she has decreased on loading air, um, air strike for the first one. Uh, heals ships as well too. Honestly, a very good ship. And I saw someone in my Discord as well too <clears throat> that used Impaired to great success in their chapter 15 clear. So if you guys need a chapter 15 ship, then honestly, go ahead and use one. But I think there's a good selection of carriers that you can use for Chapter 15, such as like um, Unicorn, Perseus is fine as well too. Um, I think the uh, Isis sisters or whatever, like uh, Thesis is alright, Albion's okay, um, Aquila's amazing, Pain Leve is great, Claudia Valence, the uh, collab ship is really, really good too. Um, Illustrious is okay. I don't think she's like the best there, but she's all right. I think she's better on the supports or whatever and whatever. And that's another thing as well too. If you guys just need like support carriers for your other fleets or whatever, then Imperial is also a solid option as well too. I will use, um, HMS though, like Illustrious, Formi, and Implacable because they have double fighter slots. But if you want to use Imperial as well too, she can honestly work there. So probably just that. And the other ships... They're not that important, but if you want to get them, by all means, go ahead and do so. Just remember, I advise you guys to always do this during a rerun. We have rerun tickets. Always do three daily pulls like that, and then skip that. And wait until like the last day before you start pulling if you really want to start getting things because you might get them with free tickets. And I say do three because you get like, what, 20-something or whatever, and three pulls gives you 300 points for the event currency, which saves you like almost 300 oil from doing like s like d3 or whatever all right so do daily three pulls and then all that jazz but yeah that's the banner not that important you can go you guys can go ahead and skip it to regenerate cubes to spend your free pulls on it three a day and you guys should be okay all right so thank you guys for watching as always i'll see you guys in the next video